Just let her dean. I'm trying to cut back. What are we even doing here? Yeah, okay, I've got another can of sardines. These are from Portugal. Somebody told me that all the best sardines are from Portugal. Uh, and I've had the Bella brand, which I like, but they're like not the best, best, best. But here we've got Porthos sardines in olive oil since 1912. They've got this nice tin of a man, you know, holding a can of his own sardines with his face. You see him holding another smaller can of sardines and it's just sardines all the way down. Okay, let's open these up. Now I've seen this brand before, so I presume they were um, easy enough to find. So just touching them up here a little bit. What is this? The scales are kind of coming off pretty easy. Skin kind of chops up pretty easy. So, I don't know. Maybe that's not a great sign. Mmm. Okay, what am I getting here? Um, a little on the fishy side. If there's any way that that's totally not a bad thing. These are kind of scaly. And there's a light amount of mush kind of on the sides. These guys are getting pretty fat though. They're pretty fat boys. Yeah, a little scaly, which is something I don't notice on other sardines. Maybe it's just sticking out to me this morning. But they've got their own flavor they're just a touch on the salty side. It's trying to get an idea what this uh, olive oil is like. Normal. Yeah, you know what? I can't say they're not pretty high quality, but um, I don't know if I'd run out and get these again. I, know I don't really like give negative reviews, but this was a brand I never really tried before. And uh, now that I have, you know, all kinds of weird expectations for what some sardines are supposed to be like. They don't quite hit the mark. And I, I do think um, you can do better for the price. Yeah, yeah, you can. Well, at least the graphic on the can is really neat, you know? Porthos. Who's Porthos? Who cares? Well, anyway, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.